and some scary moments for three children after their car is stolen while they were inside. Now four people have been charged while a fifth is still on the run. CBS 2's Mike Puccinelli has the dramatic video that you first saw here on 2. I mean, it all feels like a dream. Imam Mirateb couldn't believe it because at around 11.30 last night, she found herself face to face with a carjacker. That's the young suspect making a run for it as police are about to close in at a gas station. But earlier, he was at the wheel of the Mirateb family SUV. And he's like, get out or I'm going to shoot you. And he starts like speeding down the road. The carjacking happened outside this Domino's after her father went in to get pizza. He left the car running with 16-year-old Imama and her brother and sister inside the Toyota Highlander. The dude just hopped in. Her nine-year-old brother and five-year-old sister, seen here holding hands with the responding officer, were both asleep. Imama was about to doze off when she realized what was happening. I'm like, bro, just get out of the car. And he's like, no, you get out of the car or I'm going to shoot you. And I was Maratep like, says she feared for her life but wasn't about to leave her siblings. And I was like, I can't, there's a baby. That's when she says all three of them actually started hitting and yelling at the carjacker. They like woke up and like started helping me like to harm him so he would get out of the car. She then used her father's phone to call 911. That's when the carjacker bailed, leaving the vehicle on Devon Avenue. He then jumped into this Toyota Camry, which was filled with four accomplices. For the units from the black Camry that was stolen, the offender may have a gun, may have a gun inside the car. He threatened to shoot the victim. Police spotted the car at a West Albany Park service station and with guns drawn, approached as seen on surveillance video. They then went inside where two 19-year-old women and a young man were busted coming out of the restroom. Here you can see them being led to a squad car. But the driver who gave Imama the fright of her life hasn't been seen since he bolted from the gas station. Now safely back with her family, Imama is downplaying her bravery. I was like thinking about like how I'm going to get out of here. That's it. Well, one thing that is clear, she wasn't going anywhere without her brother and sister. The three adults and one juvenile in custody are all charged with criminal trespass to vehicles. We blurred their faces because one is underage. Police are still looking for the suspected carjacker, Charlie. Thank you so much.